Uh huh. Yeah. Extra pepperoni. Thirty minutes or it's free. Okay, great. That's oh oh eat salt shovelware's brain game. <laughs> it's your host, the dancing banana. What? I was supposed to say something interesting. Famous accordion players. <laughs> this famous accordion player is known for regularly parodying other artists' hit songs. Shapes and such. If you add up every angle of any quadrilateral, you will always get 360 degrees. With that in mind, what degree will the corners of any given square measure? The power of music. What instrument is this? I don't like that. I have a friend who can't stand spiders. He gets the absolute heebie-jeebies any time he's around one. <laughs> he can't stand their fuzzy bodies, their eight legs, their numerous eyes. What is the name of my friend's phobia? <laughs> Ha! Lucky guess!
What's the word? <laughs> We've got a very special guest backstage. Come on out, sporties! Hiya, hiya, hiya! Ready for your question? Take a gander! This image is an illustration of the process of acquiring knowledge and understanding through thought, experience, and the senses. What word best describes this? I've got to go ride some of the rides while I'm here. See you later. Shovelware Studios. As seen in Shrunken School Lobby, it's the Infrigerator from Von Bootleg Brands. That's right, it was product placement the whole time. With removable inner shelves and real boxing glove action, the Infrigerator is sure to help you keep your nefarious revenge against society properly served cold. Which of the dancing bananas' adorable and marketable nephews is the oldest? What's the word? The word fusion has many meanings, usually involving combining two or more things. Which of these is not an example of the term fusion? Not a chance. A dancing hot dog! Hey, guy, get out of there. We're trying to do a show here. Wait, what? That's the prize? We're giving away a dancing hot dog? But that's a guy. That's just a man. An alive being. No, no, this can't be right. You there, banana nephew character? Pull that rope again. Close the curtain and open it again. There's got to be a real prize behind there. It's not even the same art style. That's a character. He should be sitting in the audience right now. Do it. Pull the rope again. Okay. Okay, now pull it open again. No, that's the, the same dancing hot dog again. What are you still doing here? Banana nephew, are you in on this? Is this some kind of prank? Is this some kind of reference I'm not getting or something? Do it again. Pull the rope again. This never happens with any of our other prizes, right? You just pull it open and it's there. It's like a normal game show prize. Like some of them are funny or a little weird, but they're not a real three-dimensional person. This is just a guy. A dancing hot dog. Just pull the curtain again, and there'll definitely be a real prize behind it this time, okay? Okay. What? Is this the same dancing hot dog, but this time it's holding a rock and roll guitar? Is that what I'm seeing here? Okay, this is definitely an extended reference to something that's just going completely over my head. It has to be the entire bit transposed almost one-to-one, -one, and I am just not getting it. Right? Banana nephew? Is that your name? The middle nephew? Hey, it's not nice to ignore me. You're standing right in front of the camera, middle nephew. I know you can hear me. You're not being very helpful here. Oh. 
this dancing hot dog holding a rock and roll guitar. <laughs> you did it! You've got the biggest brain of all! That's another episode of Shovel Wears Brain Game! Now it's time to say something interesting before I tell you this episode's sponsor. Hmm. This episode is sponsored by Lazy Brand Lazy Obstacles, the leading supplier of red plastic rectangles that 